Dr. Sally here, and we're going to go through Navy's first five games of 2022. Let me write that in for you sports fans. First five games of 2022 on offense. Uh, the offense has run 324 plays. The offense has run 324 plays. Number one play they've run is the triple option, the inside veer. Yeah, they've run it 44 times. It's 14% of their offense, nine times a game. Army and Air Force have barely run inside veer. Uh, Air Force has run the influence trap triple option. Army, I don't believe they've run it more than a couple times. They've run midline triple predominantly, and that's where it's at. Number two is zone dive. They run it 43 times, 13% of the offense. They run it nine times a game. So that seems to be pretty consistent with the other two academies, other than the fact that the other two academies, their their, uh, times a game is up from that. Number three is the down, which is very surprising, but boy, Navy is running a lot of down this year, as are the other two academies. So uh, it could be interesting to see moving forward if that's going to be part of, part of the regular offense. I know I've had clients put it in regardless because it's pretty simple to run, but the down, it's been run 29 times, uh, 9% of the offense, six times a game. Wow. Number four is midline triple. I had to wedge that in there. 22 total times, 7% of the offense. They run it four times a game. Number five is triple pass, 20 times, 6% of the offense, four times a game. Number six, the trap. They run trap far less than the other two academies, but they've run it 14 times, 4% of the offense, three times a game. These six concepts are 35 plays a game of the Navy offense, which in a high school offense, that would be 65% of your offense. So that's a lot of... Offense. If you ran all this in high school, that's that would be about 65% of your offense because the average game is 48 plays a game and 35 of those are those six plays. So that's the Navy offense right now. Navy uh, has had an interesting season, losing to Delaware in the opener uh, where they were total limpy, I guess you could say. And um, that was a sad loss. And they lost to Air Force where... Frankly, they were just too gimmicky, and they lost another game. I'm trying to remember who the other loss was against, but I guess I kind of want to forget who it was against. And then the other two wins were against ECU and a massive turnaround game against Tulsa this past weekend. So Navy, we'll see what happens with them moving forward, but that's what they're doing right now. Coaches, you want to win more games in 2023? Call me.